We body it. You feel me? Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Hawa Bunka. If you're not subscribed to my channel, come and join the game. Hit the subscribe button and be a ninja right now. Um, in today's video, I'm going to be recreating Tierra Walker's full coverage mauve brown makeup look that she did a few days ago uh, i really fell in love with the look and it's not something that i've done before especially on my channel so i wanted to recreate it and put my own twist on it a little bit and this is what we came up with so if you want to see the struggle and how i got this makeup look and how you can too just keep on watching stay tuned let's get it see if i can recreate this look as a beginner makeup um person um because you know she's been in the game for years and let's see if we could pull it off i don't have a lot of the products that she used in the video so i am going to work with what i have and in case you don't know what video i'm talking about or what look i'm talking about um she did a video it's on her youtube channel i will link it below but this is the look that i am talking about Y'all see that beat? Yes. You did that, boo. I washed my face. I um also filled in my brows. I don't do much to my brows. I literally just fill them in in the spaces where I'm bald. <laughs> I'm gonna start, and I'm gonna use this Bobbi Brown. Um, it's like a moisturizer and um a moisturizer and a primer all in one i have you know the weirdest thing i have oily skin um and when i have makeup like over time my face gets super oily but like right now my face feels so freaking dry and it also i feel like has to do with like the winter time pretty dry hmm. It's raining, it's raining and sleeting and snowing outside. I'm not in the best mood. Like, I just haven't been in a good mood. I don't know why. Drink some coffee because, bitch, I'm also tired. I'm tired as hell. The next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to go in with this um, Tarte Poreless Primer. And I'm just going to put it, like, um, in the parts of my face where I get, like really oily and like my pores just come through i put it around my mouth area because i crease a lot right here my smell line i'm going to use one more primer i'm going to use the milk hydro grip primer tiara also used this in her video looks like this your makeup stick honey like your makeup shouldn't move with this primer and so you see me looking over here my mirror is here so that's why but what do y'all do when you're in a funk or you're in a mood and you know you're just not feeling your best like i have a few things that i like to do um one of them is doing makeup so that's why i'm doing my makeup today um and i just decided to record it because like why not i am a content creator so why not record it um what do y'all like to do like let me know in the comments below like what do you do when you're in a funk um i used to like when i was in college i used to like draw and stuff but i'm not into that anymore so i just need to find stuff that i like to do that will get me out of a funk besides doing makeup because um for foundations i'm going to be using this lancome in the 460 and l'oreal infallible um foundation so i'm gonna mix the two um the lancome one is in 460 sue and the l'oreal one is no so i'm gonna mix them my foundation on so i'm just going to use a beauty sponge and blend away i 
every time I do my makeup, um, my nose itch. Every single time. Every time. Never fails. Inside my nose itch. I don't understand. I don't understand why. Okay, so now that we got our foundation on, I'm looking a little ghost face. And now I'm gonna go in with the um, a Dose of Colors Concealer. Dose of Colors Concealer in Dark, number 22. I'm gonna put this on my eyelid. Now I'm gonna take um, the Anastasia Beverly Hills Translucent Powder and set my eyelids. <sighs> Too much. Too much. <laughs> Y'all, I'm gonna be all over the place with this look because I don't do stuff in order and especially I'm trying to like copy her look and I don't remember. <laughs> Now I'm going to go in with my Neutrogena Cream Radiant Concealer in Espresso, and I'm going to use this to contour my face. Wish me luck, because this stuff is a dark. take my sponge that had my foundation on it and I'm gonna pounce <laughs> on the contour because I use such a dark shade and I don't want it to look dirty. I'm gonna take the dose of colors um concealer that I used on my eyes er on my eyelid earlier And then I'm gonna blend it with a blender, a beauty blender, a beauty sponge. It's not really a beauty blender. This is actually an e.l.f. sponge that I got like in a pack. Uh, but I really like it. And I like it dirty too. So whatever. For a little extra coverage, I'm gonna use the Too Faced Multi Sculpting Concealer and I'm gonna put that right on top. I'm gonna let that sit for a second because I'm stressed out. This is stressing me. I'm just gonna add some brow gel to my eyebrows. I want this look to come out good so bad, but it's just not, it's not doing it for me. I don't know what it is. But I'm about to go in with this Neutrogena Cream Concealer. A little bit more coverage, like in this corner. I'm gonna take the Better Not Bitter powder from Beauty Bakery. Is this Beauty Bakery? Yeah, and blow it a little bit, and I put that under my eye. I am going to take my Lori Mercier, Laura Mercier powder, and I'm going to bake with this a little bit. Put a thin layer. And I'm just gonna let that bake because I need all the, I need this, this makeup look to really set in and look flawless like Tierra's did. So while we do that, I'm gonna move on to the eyes. This palette from um, Beauty Bay. And I'm gonna use this brown, this deep brown right here on my lids.
make blended out my shadow a little bit. It's giving me very much a baby. I'm going to actually mix this one and this one. With the darker, the darker color, and I'm going to go under my eyelids with that under here. gonna like line my eyes if that makes sense this Maybelline one and it's kind of like in a purple color I want to see how this looks I'm going to take my um, Fenty Beauty bronzer, <laughs> I forgot what it was, and Mocha Mami, and I'm going to bronze in my face a little. sponge and kind of bounce that contour in because I definitely went overboard with it per usual. I'm going to mist my face with this pixie vitamin wake up mist just you know So in Tierra's video, she used like a peachy type blush. So I'm going to use this e.l.f. blush palette. And I'm going to try to use, I'm going to mix this these two colors and see how I like that. Which one thing? Y'all like it? I'm gonna OD on it a little bit more though. Because I'm not using a highlight. I don't think Tierra used one. So I'm not gonna use one. And I haven't really been doing the highlight thing lately, anyways. Yeah, that looks cute. Too lash or not too lash? That is the question. Before we do that, um, the blush is looking a little bit too blushy for my liking. So, so I'm going to go with this Beauty Bay, Brown, Beauty Bay Bronzer. And I'm just going to tap over it a little bit just to calm down that blush. Because I thought I wanted a lot of blush, but I don't like it <laughs> on me. I'm going to take the Better Than Sex Mascara by Too Faced and I'm going to see if we can do that. Y'all, I ain't putting all that shit on. Before I move on to lips, I am going to set my face with the Do De Slick, with the Urban Decay De Slick, my favorite. Either this one or All Nighter. You can't tell me nothing. <laughs> They the best. Time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. 
I know I said that I wasn't going to use um, any highlight, but my homegirl has a makeup line. It's called Perfect Pop Cosmetics, and she has a um, highlight glow kit. And they're so cute. Look. Look at those colors. So I think I'm going to use... I think I'm going to use this one because I'm extra. <laughs> go off, sis. Go off! I love that. I love that. Don't go. Don't go, OD Howard. You be trying to do too much. I love that. Give me the perfect little glow. Look at it. It just sits so pretty. I'm going to use this um, lip liner from Beauty Bay in the color Vintage. I got a whole mustache. We did it, y'all. We did it. We did that. It don't look exactly like hers, but I made it my own and I like how it came out. Y'all know it was a struggle in the beginning. It was a struggle, girl. I don't know. What's up? What's your name is? Where you from? Where you came with, girl? <laughs> I think we did a damn good job. We did a good job. We never did this look before and we bodied it. You feel me? Sitting back looking at this masterpiece I created. Three hours later, like shit. Oh, girl. Y'all ever see people y'all went to school with? Never mind, let me shut up. So we're about to go take pictures. Thank you so much for watching. And if you made it to the end, definitely comment below your favorite lipstick brand. Let me know. I just want to know to see who rocked with me this entire video. And I'm going to have a treat coming up soon. Um, so you definitely want to subscribe to my channel. You definitely want to rock with me. Um, become a ninja. Like, why not? Who doesn't want to become a ninja? Like, it's, it's $1.20. But <laughs> I will catch you all in my next video. Bye.